Hello, hello, Sean here with Finally Fit. Today is uh, May the 15th on Sunday again, and I'm just actually getting ready for my week. I prepared all my food. It's exactly 14 days away from my competition, WBFF Fitness Modeling competition. And uh, for those of you who are in Vancouver, it's going to be in River Rock. Come down, watch me. It's going to be great. I'm going to be winning number one, so you might as well see it and, and celebrate together. But the point of this video, and especially with me with no shirt on, is to do two things. Is to first show you what 9% body fat looks like. It looks like this. Still a little bit of more fat left on my body, as you see. Still a little bit left. But, uh, and the second point is to actually inspire you. I feel amazing right now. I feel so good. I have so much energy. I feel great. I look great. And I want to inspire you to basically take action and do it. And I want to show you how easy it is. I just spent approximately an hour to prepare my meal. Now, that's all it takes. And you know what? I'm actually going to save money during the week because I won't be eating out. I won't be spending my money. So, in this video, I'm going to go over exactly what I'm going to be eating this week. Okay? So, here we go. The first thing I have is I'll try to hold the camera so you can still see it. I'm actually going to turn it right around and actually show you. So, first thing I have over here. Uh, I hope you can see it. Yeah, you can see it. Good. So it's the chicken. This is approximately one chicken breast. And I cut it and I added uh, turmeric, pepper, and I put it in the oven for approximately 40 minutes. And I'm going to be using one chicken breast per meal. And my, my diet is very simple. It's actually going to be pr protein shake in the morning. Then I'm going to add one tablespoon of flaxseed oil with my protein shake. So basically getting pure iso whey protein and also taking one tablespoon of fat, good fats, which is really helpful and beneficial to me, gives me energy, but at the same time doesn't make me fat. And the next meal is gonna be about two hours later, or two, three hours later, and it's gonna be what I showed you, my chicken breast right here. And then with my chicken breast, when I'm having my chicken breast, I'm also gonna add a little bit of, yes, good old broccoli and asparagus. So I already, I already uh, boiled my broccoli and asparagus, they're all ready to go so it doesn't take much time. And the next meal after that is going to be again another protein shake. That's why I have stacked all my protein shakes ready to go. Now with this meal, I'm going to have, well I call it a meal, but it's only protein. I'm also going to have eight almonds with it. That's just my nice number. It's, it's, it's enough to give me energy. It's not enough to basically, you know, basically make me uh, not, not lose the fat. So that's that. So we got all the protein shakes ready to go. I got all the broccoli ready to go, I got all the chicken ready to go, and these are each of them are one meal. And on the supplement sides, what we have here is we have the protein that I already showed you. I have the flexi oil. this is for morning. And um, there's a couple of other things I have here, actually, I'll show you. This one is, is called glutamine, and I take this before I go to bed because I want to preserve my muscles from breaking down. So if you uh, are doing empty uh, stomach cardio first thing in the morning, it's recommended by the experts to take L-glutamine to preserve your muscles. And the other supplements that I take is vitamin C. I think everybody should be taking it. I take about two, three tablets a day, so about 1,500 milligrams. And also, I take a generic multivitamin. Now, this is at this time, at this point. A lot of times as I grow, as I evolve, I learn that, hey, I can improve things. I'm not saying my way is the best way, but it works for me and it works for my clients. So. I suggest, if you like, follow this advice. Don't make any change to your diet before talking to your nutritionist and your doctor, but if you like, you can follow my advice, and that's the results that I'm getting. So, if you like, do it. Oh, one other thing is, I actually, for the, ne for the next two weeks, I'm going to be doing things a little differently, just because this is an extreme level. This is not me just trying to lose a little bit of fat. This is trying to me getting rid of that last bit of fat that's on my lower abs. So in order to do that, I need to take things to the extreme level, which means I'm going to be adding a little bit of caffeine and a little bit of ephedrine first thing in the morning. And that's going to be probably about, you know, 100 milligrams in the morning and about 60 milligrams of ephedrine in the morning. And again, you need to talk to your doctor if you want to take any supplements. I don't actually believe in supplements and I don't take them. But as I mentioned, this is competition and I'm going to be number one WBFF pro to inspire a lot of people. So in order to do that, I'm going to take the caffeine and the ephedrine. So I hope you found this video useful. As you see, it's very simple. It takes one hour, chicken, broccoli, and protein shake, and almonds. How easy is that? Now, you may be saying, what about the cravings? Yeah, you are going to be craving food. You are going to be craving uh, other stuff. 
but hey, you know what, you have to give something in order to take, and I'm willing to pay the price, so that's about it. Have an amazing day. If you have any other suggestions, questions, write to me. I read all your emails, and I'd like to hear more from you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.